Adelaide 2020, and I'm introducing the gray-headed flying fox, inflatable. And uh, there's a whole group of flying foxes living in the botanic gardens here. They've been here about 10 years, and they're actually part of Adelaide's, uh, in Adelaide's care, the city. And late, earlier in the year, they asked me if I'd make an inflatable so they could have a focus for storytelling and education about the flying fox. So today, they, we've got uh, children doing the costumes. You see some uh, flying fox, little ones flying around in the grounds. And then we have various storytellers, and they'll be inside the lady fox for a story, batty, batty stories. I've been interested in recycling and the reuse of waste materials. About 20 years ago, we found a rag company that had a train car load of nylon fabric left over from tents. And since nylon does not absorb water, it was a material they, you know, just had us use. And one of the materials was this nylon cord, it's salvage cord that's left over from lingerie manufacturing. So all the costumes and the inflatables and all of my work is using nylon in various ways. Some of it has been, uh, you know, throwaways from tenting company and eventually I've had to buy some new one. One of the other materials I've enjoyed using is videotape, which go over here. This kelp curtain has been recycled, made from actual television from Canada and Australia in the 1970s and 80s before the digital area. This is two inch videotape that actually has the television programs on it. And I still happen to have reels of this. There's one mile of tape in one reel. And by crocheting and weaving, I've made a curtain and we're gonna keep adding on to this. Because this kelp curtain is the beginning of a new awareness of replanting seagrass and seaweed in the oceans. We're going to call our new show Kelp Me. Help Me. So the growing of seagrass and the background. And here we have the bunyip. This bunyip monster, he lives in the kelp forest or he lives in the wetlands and he sort of represents some of the Aboriginal mythology, but he could have other names for other countries. And he's also made with nylon. And we can have children go inside him. He's got little pockets here where the little faces will come out. <laughs> so he's new, this is part of the monster show. And we have dinosaurs. <laughs> See, each different species is in here. Dinosaur monsters. And we have little flying fox costume. See? They all have the orange fur. This is the gray headed flying fox that you see flying all over here. And soon you'll see children. Yes, you can open the gates.